All right, so I've come to realize that I have done an absolutely horrible job of explaining what the Order Project is. So here it is. I've drawn an illustration to kind of allow us to understand what is what is the Order Project, and so I provide for you the House of Order. The House of Order. Okay, so here's how it's going to work. The House of Order is the Order Project itself, right? So this is like where all the stuff is. On the top floor, the main purpose of me doing this is to create a catechetical series. And it's going to be called Growing with Ardor. And so, in that catechetical series, what I'm going to do is I'm going to create parent videos and children's videos that have a little bit more excitement in them, that are a little bit more modern. And so I wanted to create something that was, I don't know, a little bit more catching. Also that focused on the parents themselves, because the truth is, I don't know that the parents know this any better than the kiddos do. So that's why this is getting created. Growing with Ardor is going to be sacramental preparation. There will be first reconciliation. There will be first Eucharist. I'm going to have a parents video that prepares them for baptism. How do we live out our baptism as well? I'm going to have preparation for uh, confirmation. Because the teenagers, they want to know the intricacies of it. How do we embrace that flourishing of the gifts of the Holy Spirit? I was clapping while I was talking and I don't know that you heard me. How do we embrace those gifts of the Holy Spirit? How do we allow ourselves to live out a life of faith? Then what I'm going to do, and this is going to exist for all of the sacraments themselves. This is important. Okay. So the second component within the House of Ardor is Brewing Ardor. That's just going to be a podcast. It's going to be an audio morning thing that I'm going to release from you know, a couple days a week. And what Brewing Ardor actually is, is just discussing elements of the faith, talking about all kinds of random questions that people are going to submit by way of Twitter and other places, and I'm going to host these little podcasts. They're going to be brief, anywhere from, I don't know, 5 minutes to 15 minutes, so that as you're commuting to work, or while you're on the treadmill in the morning, or wherever you are, whatever you're doing, you can listen. And it's to bring us to a greater understanding of the Catholic faith. It's to allow us to get what it is that we are called to do as Catholics. Finally, the bottom floor, which is kind of the least important, but it's important for me, is the living with ardor. Now, it's not that living with ardor itself is actually not important. Living with ardor is going to be the daily vlog, or it's going to be the semi-daily vlog, because it's not going to be able to happen every day, because I'm sorry, I don't have that much free time. Or living with ardor is going to be is the video blogs, the vlogging, so that A, I can learn to film better, B, B, I want to be able to allow myself to share what does it look like to be a priest. What is the priesthood? There are days where I am, you know, doing counseling. There are days where I am trying to find scholarship for families that are needing it. You never know what your days are going to be like. I want to share that stuff. I want to talk about that stuff. And how do we live that out? How do we glorify God with a positive attitude? That is the house of ardor. And so I'm going to call that a wrap. Hopefully, if I've explained it clearly enough, I look forward to seeing you all soon. May God bless each and every one of us and guide us on the path to holiness. Be good to each other.